Michelle, I'm an R&B, hip hop, singer songwriter, and that's where my fans would know me from, like back in the day. My name is Robert Stewart, but most people call me Chef Stew. You may have seen me on Food Network's Cutthroat Kitchen or Guys Grocery Games. I'm dating a guy who is younger than myself, and I would like to know if it's true, because I don't want to waste any more of my time. The story changes every couple of days. I went from a stalker to a really nice guy. I was personal chef to actress comedian Lunell. She had me over for a holiday, wanted me to come and cook for some of her family and friends. And it just so happens that Michelle a actually was one of the invitees to the event. And I seen her and I'm saying, damn, who the hell is this? And shortly after she came into the house, she started talking. I'm saying, I only know one person in the world who talks like this. So that has to be Michelle a. And from that, I just was like, I had my eye on her. He just kept staring at me, and then when I would glance his way, he, would, he wouldn't even turn away, he would just go. I was, I was waiting like, for you to finish because if somebody's staring at you, how do you notice that they're staring at you? Well, I You're mean, looking back at them. So to make a long story short, he gets my number from Lunel. He calls me, I call him two months later, and we did this for a year. I decided to come. We had a few issues, and I thought this would be the perfect place to do it so that other people can help me make a good decision because as you guys know, I don't always make the best choices in men. The men in your life have taught you a horrible lesson and that's that love hurts. Absolutely, right? I agree with you. I'm not a victim of my journey. I just wanted somebody to love me. What I'm looking for now is to move past that because I have to grow. I came to boot camp as a way to just basically see if I could strengthen the relationship I have with Michelle. You know, my biggest fear was getting to know you, because now I really know you, right? I also know you now. <laughs> she feels that I am so busy wanting to be with somebody that's half my age. They surrounded our room with a bunch of girls. I don't know whose idea that was, but take them girls down off the wall. Only girl I'm looking at right now is her. The silliest thing that we argue about, I would say would have to be my repertoire and my morning routine for Kissing. showing affection. Yeah. Michelle seems to think that it's kind of not the coolest it's thing in the world to do to brush your teeth before you want to tongue kiss somebody. Why? It's kind of like some things just have to be left better unsaid. What do I want boot camp fans to know about me before they watch? Please know that I'm a chef and so the, my performance and my music talents and stuff that I normally just keep to myself in the shower. So please don't chastise me. But I did come out of my element slightly and try to keep up with some hip hop legends. And I just want them to know that I'm facing failure forward with a new boyfriend, letting that past go that we all. And I want you guys to see my new journey and come on it with me.